Hello. Well, we're on grid bypass right now. It's somewhere around one o'clock in the afternoon. We went ahead and uh, took some of this stuff apart. My batteries are down 27%. When they get up to about 35, they'll switch back over to solar. I haven't had my solar connected. I just wanted to show you guys this. So, I went ahead and uh, put some uh, breakers out at my solar panels. That way I could isolate them, shut them off, and if something happens, I can turn off one set of solar panels and have the other three up and running and figure out if I have a bad solar panel or something like that without shutting down the whole array. So, I figured I'd uh, go ahead and get that done. And uh, it looks pretty good. We'll uh, go out there and take a look. Of course, all the dogs are paying attention. So this is what we did. I've got earlier, earlier videos showing uh, this box with a bunch of wires and just some um, MC4 connectors in there. And I went ahead and put in the breakers. That way I could just shut it off and work on them if something happens. We went ahead and ran the wires straight over and in and down so there's no there's no connectors in between where they hook up to the solar panels and then they come in here there's no other connectors and uh it makes it a little bit cleaner and less chance to have a faulty mc4 connector or something like that so we're gonna zip tie some of them wires in place better especially like right here get them cleaned up a little bit nicer so but Figured I'd go ahead and show you guys what I did here. So, I, I figured that was a good thing to get that done. So, and down there, if you see, if you can see, there's white tape on there. There's some black tape up on those ones. <laughs> These connectors here have red tape. And these ones have green tape. Okay. So, this is black, that's that far end, white, red, and green, and that's the order that the, each series is up on the array. And then the wires are marked going inside. So, I could shut one of these off. These are both going, I, both of these go to that one inverter and uh, we're gonna redo that 
I'm only going to have two inverters running my system. I don't need three of them. And I'll use the other one only as a battery charger. So we'll do a video on that, you know, after we get it done. I don't know if we're going to do that tomorrow or what, but it's, uh, it's one of those things that's in the works. Anyways, I just wanted to get this all cleaned up and we're going to go ahead and get those zip tied up there. Anyways, thank you for watching.